Okay, hi guys and welcome back to the channel. This is a very impromptu and very short video where I just wanted to have a quick look at the new releases of Amiga. So I have them here in front of me. Um, so let's start off with the new Planet Ocean line, the uh, Ultra Deep, which is water resistant to 6,000 meters, which is incredible, honestly. Um, 6,000 meters of water resistance. And I think it's really cool that it is a time only watch which makes it even more so a proper tool watch. And uh, this is based off a prototype that I think was launched in 2019. And the prototype actually went down the Mariana Trench, the deepest point on earth, down to 10,000 something meters, which is really um, incredible. Now this one, the one that is in production for the general consumer is 6,000 meters water resistant. And the most important thing um, about this watch is that it actually has four awaiting patents. And one of them is a, a new type of steel that Amiga uh, uses in this watch. Apart from the titanium version, they use a Omega steel, which Amiga says is 50% stronger and more resistant as compared to conventional stainless steel used in watches. So very exciting things um, amongst other patents that reinforce um, and facilitate the water resistance of this watch. So Amiga again pushing the boundaries at what they do, which is um, really exciting because they're showing that they are still in the game. They are still keeping up with Rolex and other brands. Rolex obviously being their biggest competitor, but even brands like Tudor and other brands in that price range. And Amiga just showing that they are there and launching um, groundbreaking stuff. Now, another release I am quite excited about because I actually predicted this one is the green version of the Seamaster Diver 300. This is a prediction I made this year and I, I always thought to myself, why is there not a green version of this uh, beautiful watch? As it seems, the specs are the same as for um, the previous Seamaster Diver 300. So uh, ceramic bezel, ceramic dial, but I'm really looking forward to how this watch actually looks in person. And then the last uh, of the releases that I will go into today is the Speedmasters, this two new gold Speedmasters. Just when we thought we had enough Speedmasters, no, Amiga obviously launched um, again a new Speedmaster, not a new Speedmaster, but new versions of the 3861 model and this two, um, there's two yellow gold versions. So one with a green dial and bezel, which is so exciting because I love that combination. Obviously direct competitor to the um, yellow gold Rolex Daytona with a green dial. And then also competitor to another Rolex Daytona is the yellow gold uh, on the black rubber strap. That's the first time Amiga makes a rubber strap or puts as it seems an integrated rubber strap on a Speedmaster and they're obviously competing here with the Daytona on the Oyster Flex. So really exciting stuff and again these are two pieces that um, I can't wait to actually see them in person and see how the rubber feels, what type of rubber this is comparing it to the Daytona. Obviously as a Speedmaster owner I know that the watch in and of itself is superb but now Seeing it in uh, yellow gold, I already handled the uh, Sedna gold version and I made a review on that. So if you haven't checked that out, check it out here on the tab that I'll leave for you. But seeing it in yellow gold and with green accents or the rubber strap is, is again something different and I think it looks good, but um, definitely excited to see that in person. We are also really excited to have partnered up with watch charts, which provide you with all the data and analytics that you need to find your next watch at the best possible price with the best possible dealer. Now, if you want 20% off, you can use our code, the watch scientists uh, that I leave here and you'll get the premium membership at 20% discount. It's really worth it to find your next luxury watch for the best price. And that's already it for uh, me today, guys. I just wanted to give you a quick overview of the most exciting stuff that Amiga released today. So do let us know in the comments down below 
if you found this content interesting and which of these new releases you find the most interesting. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time. Ciao.